today I give you an example how to define if, given, if the given function uh, convex, convex or concave within some intervals. Example, concave or convex function. Mm -hmm. Examples. If you watch the previous videos, you know that with the criteria um, or if the given function is concave or convex uh, is the sign of the second derivative. So, if the second derivative of the function is positive, is more than zero, function is is convex is a convex function. function so schematically it's kind of this curve which sloped look down and the second one if it is negative or less than zero it is concave some people say convex downward this function and convex upwards if the, the same concave. You can use any term. I'm used to concave and convex function terms. Convex function and concave function. And it's very easy to check it. I use, I give you two very easy examples here. Example, uh, for example, we have y equal x squared. If you calculate the second derivative, first we have to calculate the first one derivative, the first derivative which is 2x, and the second derivative is 2. You can see that 2 is always positive, since that this function is always uh, is convex function is a convex function is a convex function mm -hmm. the second one example so let's do investigate y equal x cube let's calculate the second the first derivative which is 3 x squared clear yes. and the second one derivative which is 3 x squared derivative is 6x. Six, six. Six, six. Uh, you can notice that if 6x six, six, uh, more than 0, uh, so it's x more than 0, since that 6x six, six is less than 0, where x and x is negative. So we can say that when x is positive, uh, the second derivative is positive, so function is convex function. And then x negative is this, it is concave function. Concave function. What does it mean? We can make very schematical view of this graph. It is zero here, x y. Mm -hmm. Then x is negative, it is concave function, so its slope looks up, up. and uh, when x is positive, its slope looks down. So it means that this function has very schematic view, like this curve, I use this red, uh, red, black, in, and you can see that here slope looks down, it is uh, conve a convex function has a convex function here. When x is negative, it is a concave function. Mm -hmm. So that's enough for today. You can see the very short, very brief explanation. And this one approach you can use for whatever function you might ta you might take. Uh, it is logarithm, sine, cosine, whatever you want. You can check if it is concave or convex function. If you calculate its 
the second derivative. See you later. Bye-bye.